てます。次のご質問。はい、OK。Should I say something?OK、okay. sure.。Um, thank you.Yes,、uh, that, 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 the sort of pivotal scene that I guess you're、uh, alluding to when, when、um, between Bilbo and Gollum, when Bilbo chooses not to take Gollum's life and in Bilbo's ears are ringing Gandalf's words, true courage is knowing not when to take a life but when to spare it. Um, I think this says something about Tolkien's humanity.、Um, I, I think it's true. I hope it's true.、Um, just as a general adage, I hope it's true.、Uh, and when, also, when you've been on the receiving end of Ian McKellen saying it to you, that, that kind of helps. Because <laughs>、uh, I think it helps an audience, but it also helped me、um, carry, that, carry that through.、Um, yeah, I think it's a, it's, a, it's a lovely moment for Bilbo. It tells you a lot about Bilbo and where he's going. You know, where he's going, literally.、Uh, that this responsibility doesn't sit lightly with him. He takes it very seriously.、Um, he's not a person who is quick to violence or quick to anger or aggression.、Um, it wouldn't suit him to kill a defenseless being anyway,、um, even in fear, even if it's a life and death situation for him, it wouldn't sit well with him.、Um, so I think, yeah, I think it、um, is a good indicator of, well, Bilbo, Tolkien,、um, life, hopefully.、Yeah. そうですね、あの今まさにですね、その哀れみ、そしてまああのゴラムとそしてあのビルボの非常にですね、まあ重要なあのまあ瞬間、場面の話をされておりましたけれども、あのまあガンダルフの言葉の中で、人間の勇気というのは本当の意味でその人を救うときに、まあその勇気というものが試されるものだということをあのまあいう,いうセリフがありますけれども、まさにこれが人間性であり、それがあのまあ私は真実だとあの信じたいです。そしてまたこれがですね、いやまクランさんが言うことでさらにまあその真実味が増すというところもあると思うんですけれどもやはり私があのまあ演じるこの役は非常に私は責任があって責任が重いものだと思ってあのやあの演じておりましたので、まあ、そういうような言葉があって支えられたことでさらに私の役作りというかそういうものがあのまあの基本になったと思いますそしてまたですねビルボというのは元からそんなに急に怒ったりとか感情をあらわにするような、まあ、そういう性格ではありませんのでもしその相手がまあ自分が殺してしまえるような場面があったとしても、おそらくまあ彼の性格では、どんなに恐ろしい場面でも、どんなに怒っているような時でも、おそらく、そしてまたあのまあ死ぬか生きるかというような場面でも、おそらく彼の性格ではなかなかその,まあ人あのその場所で殺してしまおうというふうにはえならなかったと思いますということです、うんはい、ありがとうございます。あのクイズコーナーが面白かったですね、<笑>高くね<笑>で、はい、どうぞそちらの中井のお話メリークリスマス、RSK 山陽放送の愛田と申します<笑>、えー、ピーター・ジャクソン監督にお伺いしたいんですけども、監督がこの作品で一番目指したものとは何でしょうか、そしてあの出演者の皆さんには、やはり8年ぶりのこの壮大なプロジェクト、また出演できる喜びをぜひお聞かせください。The aim of、uh, making the movie is really for, for me,、um... With any movie I make, it's escapism, really. I, I love the, the mystery and the romance of going to the cinema.、Um, I always have since I was a child. And, and, and th there are many different types of films to suit many people, but the type of film I like to watch, and, and therefore the type of film I really like to make, are, are ones in which you are transported into an adventure.、Um, there's characters with emotional depth. But beyond all else, you're, you're, it's, it's an escapist experience,、um, which is why I think the, I, I love fantastical films, and obviously, Tolkien's books are really the ultimate example of,、um, of, of uh, being, you know, of a story that transports you away into a world that's, that's familiar. It has characters who are familiar, it has themes that are familiar, yet it has the exotic. Um, you know, the, ex the exotic, fantastical elements of the creatures and the goblins and trolls and things.、Um, so for me, it's,、um, it's an extension of a fairy tale. It's why I,、um, you know, it's, it's what I love about films, just、um, fairy tales for every everybody, really. 
あの私が映画を作る一番の理由というのが、えー、逃避です,逃避です、えー、これはですねあの本当にミステリーですとかロマンスとかそういうものを求めて映画を僕は見ます子どもの頃から映画が大好きで、えー、もちろんいろんなタイプの映画ってありますが私が好きな映画そしてで,すですから作る映画っていうのはやはりこの、えー、逃避できる全く違う世界に連れて行ってくれるそういうような作品なんです。えー、そしててまたキャラクターがとってもあの感情移入できるイモーショナルなそういうものが好きなんですねですからそういう皆さんにも逃避的体験をしていただきたいですから当然ファンタジーっていうのが一番ふさわしくてまあトルキーンさんの書いているものっていうのはあの究極のファンタジーと言えると思うんですね私たちが知っているようでまあ実は非常にエキゾチックなそういう世界観、えー、ゴブリンや、えー、トロールやいろんなものが出てくるそういうクリーチャーが出てくるまさに、えー、おとぎ話そういうあのファンタジーのものが私は好きです。はい、じゃあ出演者の皆様にお一人ずつ伺いますか。はい、じゃあアンディサーキスさん。It's it's been an incredible experience、uh, coming back to New Zealand and and shooting The Hobbit、um, and a, and a wonderful time to get together with very old friends、um,。Meet the crews that, that were present on those films in the Lord of the Rings days, come back, and, and everyone's slightly older and got more children.、Um, and, and then, of course, welcoming the new cast,、um, which were phenomenally dedicated, really hard working, great fun to be around.、Um, for me, I had, I had a wonderful time because、uh, not only was I reprising the role of Gollum, but Peter asked me to direct the second unit, and I had the opportunity to. to、uh, experience the, the, the great work that all of these、uh, actors did and,、uh, and to learn a lot from Peter as well. He was incredibly generous with, with、uh, enabling me to, to move into an area that I'm interested in.、Um, so, f- 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 for, for a year and a half, we, we became a brand new family on a brand new adventure, which was, which was thrilling. It was immensely challenging, logistically, physically, mentally challenging. But,、um, When you've got great people around you, an amazingly talented team who are all you know, working for 150%、um, it, it, it's a joy.、Mm. あのまたニュージーランドに戻ってですねホビットこの世界に戻れるっていうのはとっても僕にとっては嬉しい、えー、楽しいことです、えー、そして、えー、古い、まあ、旧友とも出会いがありまして、まあ、多くのスタッフがですね、えー、ロード・オブ・ザ・リングで会った人たちで、えー、多少年を取って子供が増えたというそういう、えー、関係で,しでした。で新しいキャストのメンバーもたくさんいました,いましたし、えー、本当にみんな一生懸命仕事をする楽しい人たちなんですねで、えー、僕は今回ですねゴラムという役をもう一度あの演じるという機会に恵まれたのと同時にあのピーターの方から僕がすごく興味が持っていた演出の方も、えー、セカンドユニットの監督を任されました、えー、これはもう本当に1年半ですね、えー、新しいファミリー新しい、えー、冒険を楽しんだと同時に非常にチャレンジングでしたしピーターからいろんなことを学ぶこともできましたしみんなが 150% 出し切ってそして本当に楽しい映画を作りました、はい、すごいですね多かったですもんねゴラムのアップ<笑>そうですね<笑><笑>イライジャウッドさん、uh, Yeah, I mean to, to what Andy just said、um, was so extraordinary because it's sort of The experience of, of making The Hobbit, it seems, was, you know, very much echoed the experience of making Lord of the Rings in terms of, you know, the incredible effort, the, the passion amongst、um, the actors and filmmakers and, and crew.、Um, and it was beautiful to see, to, to come back to that. And for me, it was also so special、um, to see that the atmosphere on set was very much the same.、Uh, you know, in, in some ways, the scale of, of The Hobbit. It seemed much larger in a way,、um, but the, the intimacy and, and connection amongst the people working was very much the same.、Um, it was a gift, you know, it was an absolute gift to come back. I, I, I had certainly thought that that chapter in my life had, had been closed,、um, certainly not, not my connection to those people and to New Zealand, but to be asked to come back and, and sort of briefly reprise the role of Frodo was. Was a gift, mainly to, to go back to New Zealand and, and to see you know, Ian McKellen as Gandalf again and, <laughs>、um, mm-hmm. and to, to work with Ian Holm again、um, and to see old family and friends. And, and to, you know, it was a joy for me to meet the new cast、um, who were you know, deeply entrenched in a journey very similar to what we'd gone through. And it was a, 
a joy to, to spend time with them and, and to sort of vicariously live through this new journey that they were all on, and, and it was a beautiful thing to witness. あのまさにまあのアンディが言ったことと同じなんですけれども本当にあの素晴らしいやはり機会体験でしたあの今回の「のホビットの冒険」あのであのメンバーが、えー、旅をするその,あの経験というのは実は「ロード・オフ・ザ・リング」で我々が旅の仲間が経験したことと本当に写し鏡のような経験なのなんですねであのそこでまた現場に戻りますとあの本当にその熱い情熱と愛情を持ったキャストスタッフが集結してこの